Behind me are ministers from more than 30 countries who've been meeting to discuss how they've been implementing the WIZ's action lines and also what they can learn from each other. It is every single person's role to make sure that the virtual world is a, remains a space where we want to be, but it's also the responsibility of the private sector and also governments to make sure that every single person knows how to use digital tools and technology beneficially and well. Now that um, we're seeing the gaps that are prevalent um, as um, the connectivity, as the digitalization is uh, being rolled out, government actually will have to play a very vital role in um, laying out the the necessary policy and guidance in terms of rules of conduct. Elsewhere, other crucial meetings on the WIZIS action lines continued. While internet access has grown worldwide, vast areas of the globe are still being left behind. This high-level policy session turned to trying to find solutions. One representative from the many NGOs gathered here thinks that in many countries in Africa, the private sector is too focused on profitability rather than on the public good of internet access for all, and that needs to change. The return on investment in Africa is only about 3% of that what it is in Europe. Then you immediately understand why you wouldn't invest in Africa if you as a telecom want to have return on investment. But it should be a human right to have access to information on the internet, like access to governmental information, access to health information, access to education. Of course, this forum is not just about intense rounds of meetings. It's about creating relationships and bonding, and evening yoga sessions for all create well-being and build relationships. We've been in this hectic session, so obviously I will be a bit relaxed um, after it and, and internalizing everything that we've been dealing with the whole day today. Relaxed and rejuvenated, the WIZIS Forum participants are now ready for the last two days of action-packed activity. So join us tomorrow for more highlights.